Hey, I'm Chris, and this is Adler Up Close. Meet Frank. At the age of 18, Frank lied about his sexuality to fight Nazis in World War II. He went on to study astronomy for the U.S. military, at least until his boss found out he was gay. He was fired. So, he gave up. Just kidding. He sued, and brought his case all the way to the Supreme Court. It was the first civil rights claim based on sexual orientation in U.S. history. But the court refused to hear his case. So, then, he gave up. Just kidding. In the 1960s, he helped bring a national gay rights organization to Washington, D.C. After years of working for the government, now he had to fight to make it better. Then he won a court case for Otis Francis Tabler, helping Tabler to become the first openly gay person to receive a U.S. security clearance. On top of that, he also helped convince the American Psychiatric Association that homosexuality was not a mental illness. Frank wasn't a lawyer, but he changed the law. Or a psychologist, but he changed psychology. He was one of the nation's foremost gay activists and an astronomer. There's even an asteroid named after him, because he rocks. Get it?